I think. Yeah. Uh, er, I think earlier. Okay, then it's uh, A then. What is up, everybody? We are back with another episode of Street Smart with Rashid. I am your host, Rashid Kareem Shati. And we are here today on the world famous Hollywood Walk of Fame. A lot of people are out here walking about, looking at their favorite movie stars. So clearly they know a lot about the celebs and the movies. Let's see how much they know about the Los Angeles Dodgers. What is your name and where are you from? Sailor from Wyoming. My name's Kuhn and I'm from the Netherlands. My name's Miles Cover. I'm originally from Oklahoma, but uh, I moved here uh, about three years ago, and so I'm Hollywood proud. I love LA, I love everything about this place. And uh, if I'm not, you said that you're a baseball guy, am I, am I right? Yes, I enjoy the sport of baseball. Let's test your baseball knowledge, because these questions are about the Dodgers. What year? Did the Dodgers move to Los Angeles? A, 1958, B, 1962, or C, 1966? C. I'm going with B. Do you think 1962? I think, yeah. Uh, er, I think earlier? Okay, then it's uh, A then. My family's saving me. Mm, I think my finance is gonna be a uh, 66. The connection's there, 1958 is correct. Before my day. Wow, okay, so I was way off. All right, all right. A little older franchise than, than you realize. Kids are dancing, the kids love it. One for one, this is a family affair. The owner at the time also convinced the owner of their rivals, the New York Giants, to also move to California to preserve their rivalry. And the San Francisco Giants are their main rivals wow. to this day. Wow, wow, that's crazy. That's really dope. Which Dodger had his own blank mania? Is it A, Jackie Robinson? B, Sandy Koufax, or C, Fernando Valenzuela? I think Jackie Robinson, I think, has his own stadium. But, I mean, that's an obvious answer, though, but I'll still go with it. I'm going with B. C. C is correct. How'd you know that? I didn't. Fernando Mania swept the team when he joined as a pitcher especially after he led the team to a World Series win as a rookie. So all it takes is one guy to get a whole team fired up. That's the truth, man. I agree. Our final question is a health question sponsored by D-Herbs. The Dodgers have a pitcher named Walker Bueller who needed surgery to strengthen his elbow ligaments. What is this surgery called? A, ACL surgery, B, Tommy John surgery, or C, slap repair? I would say A. You know what? I'll, I'll go with the third one. Why not? Go and slap. Go and slap. I'll, I'll try that. I've never heard of it, you know, but that might be something, you know. I don't know what Tommy Gunn is or the, uh, the other one. I think it's the B, Tommy John surgery. No hesitation. Bang. That's correct. Tommy John surgery. It's Tommy John surgery, man. It's oof. Uh, baseball players are prone to overuse injuries, especially in the arm, and Tommy John surgery is effectively a ligament transplant to repair the damaged ones in the elbow. It's very common among pitch pitchers and has gone from a 1% to an 85% success rate since it was first invented. I had fun, you know, I had fun in doing this, you know. Hey, uh, everybody. Uh, I just took the Street Smart Challenge by D Herbs. So I'm Kuhn. I played the Street Smart game. Thank you, D Herbs. Hi, I'm Miles Cover from Hollywood, and I just did Street Smarts with D Herbs. All right, guys, that wraps up another episode of Street Smart with Rashid. Thank you all so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, leave a comment, and tune in again next week for another episode.